Welcome back everyone to Catherine's Plates where it's always simple, easy, and delicious in my kitchen. Today I've just pulled out some pantry items so I can make chocolate peanut butter brownies for you guys. You ready for this one? A delicious combo of flavor for sure. All right, let's go ahead and put these easy brownies together. We're gonna start off with a large bowl. I'm gonna crack two eggs that I brought to room temperature into the bowl. To the eggs, we're gonna add one cup of white granulated sugar. Just gonna take a whisk. I'm gonna blend this all together until it's nice and smooth and creamy. All right, it's nice and smooth, all well incorporated, and nice and creamy. We're gonna add half a cup of melted butter, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, quarter teaspoon of salt. We're gonna whisk this again until it's all well incorporated. We're gonna sift in half a cup of all-purpose flour. We're gonna whisk this in. We're gonna add in half a cup of unsweetened cocoa powder. All right, let's mix this all together. I'm just gonna switch over to a spatula. Scrape the sides. Now we don't want to over mix. We're going to set this off to the side so that we can make our peanut butter mixture. I've got a medium bowl. I'm going to put in half a cup of some creamy peanut butter. Mm. Oh my gosh, I love peanut butter. <laughs> it's going to be so good going together with the chocolate. I think that's going to be for me. <laughs> I've got three tablespoons of melted butter that I'm going to add. I'm going to cream these together. You want to make sure it's all combined before we start our next step. You want it smooth and silky. Yep, that looks good. Yep. We're gonna add half a cup of some powdered sugar. I'm just gonna do it slowly, so about a quarter cup and then the other quarter cup. All right, we're gonna fully combine this. You want to make sure there's no lumps in there, so just using the back of your spatula, just push down on the bottom. All right, we're going to set this aside. I'm lay out a piece of parchment paper and put my hand on it. I'm going to take a pair of scissors and I'm just going to cut up to the edge of the pan on all corners, and you're gonna do them twice. So I'm gonna cut on this end, 
and then cut on this end and you want to leave the ends on so don't cut through them we're going to remove the pan we're just going to make folds so go to the end of where you cut and then just fold All right, now that we got that in a square, we're gonna take off these ends. All right, let's bring our pan back over. We're gonna place our parchment inside and it should fit all the way down to the end in the corners. We're just going to prop this out. This will help us get the brownies out at the end. Then we're going to stand those up. There we go. What I'm going to do is just seam this one right here so it stays and then seam this one. Okay, there we go. We're going to put all of the brownie mixture into the bottom of our baking dish here. All right, I'm just going to take my spoon and spread this evenly. Make sure you hold your parchment paper. We're gonna take our peanut butter mixture here and we're just going to dollop it all over the brownie mix. Just use two spoons, that'll help you dollop it. All right, let me spread this out. Take a knife and you're just going to swirl the peanut butter into the brownie mix. We're going to place this in the oven that's been preheating at 350 degrees for 30 to 35 minutes. This will be done when you can stick a toothpick in the brownie part and it comes out nice and clean. I'll be back. All right, I've just pulled these out of the oven. We're going to allow these to cool completely and then we're going to pull them out by the paper here slice these and then I'm going to give them a try for you. I've allowed these to cool down completely. I'm going to pull them out. We're going to cut these. Here they are. Don't they look delicious? Mmm. Look at that. You know, it's got a nice cake consistency to it. Fudgy. A nice peanut butter swirl all through it. I'm going to give this a try for you. Honestly, you guys. You need to give me a thumbs up on this one. These are amazing. <laughs> I already tried a bite, but let me try another bite for you. Mm. Y'all, don't make a boxed brownie mix, okay? You saw how easy this one was to put together. Make your own. It's so delicious. It's scrumptious. Oh my gosh, I don't know how many words there are. Mm -mm. I love the thickness of it. 
and they're very fluffy on the inside, kind of a fluffy fudge. <laughs> yeah. Make your own and give these a try. They're so good. There you go. Give me a thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and that bell notification. That way you'll always know when shows like this one here are posted. I will see you on my next episode. Mm.